Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome back to another review from Roy's Reviews. And today we're having, yeah, to follow up on the pods, we're going to do some pod salts. Yeah. So we've got four flavours today from pod salts, and I'm not going to be going through my normal, this is a vape bed and do all the music and the speedy up bits. Because this stuff is pod salt, I'm not going to chain vape them. Now, Need to say, I have been vaping these in a few different devices. Um, in the Mido and also in the Valadin, just so that I can get an idea of what they're like in different devices. Now, before I start, what I will say is when I describe the flavours in the Mido, when you first put them into it, you don't get the full flavour. But if you let, you actually let the um, just soak in overnight and come back to the next day you are getting the full flavours so the flavours that I will be describing will be the full flavours but for best results I've actually found that the Vladen actually works the best on there so I'm not going to take you in the boxes and all of these juices because they are basically all the same apart from the names that's on there now pod salts do come in different strengths and the camera's not one to play. It's my ugly mug's probably in the camera frame. But they do come in these lovely boxes that's got pod salts hit the spot on it. It tells you what it is, and this is the um, Vapor's Oven. This is a lemon cake, and it's a 20 milligram um, nicotine, so 2% nicotine. It says this product contains nicotine, which is a highly addictive substance. It's got the ingredients. On the back, it just tells you this is a nicotine salt product formulated for smokers, dual users and those seeking low throat irritation from a high nicotine dose. And it's got the man manufacturers which is My Vapory and their contact details UK. Now they come in 10ml bottles like so. Camera. There we go like so, the 10ml bottle, which has got all the same information it has on the box around the outside. And you do get another leaflet on the inside, which has got all your different warnings on it, and actually shows you what to do with them, if you don't already know. Okay, so the first one up is, is a lemon cake, and it is in a 10ml bottle. And I have it currently in the little Mido pod. Now, what you get from this is a lot more of the cake and the lemon is more of an afterthought. So instead of lemon cake, it could be cake lemon. It is, um, but it is a lovely, lovely little um, cakey flavour, bakery flavour you get to that with a nice um, sharp lemon that's coming through there it's been an all-day vape and yeah I would say it would be an all-day vape but I hope there's just something missing from it for me there's just something not hitting that 100% spot um, so I would give the lemon cake Camera doesn't want to play. Lemon cake, an 8 out of 10. So next up is vanilla pod salt. Now, people who know me know that I do like vanillas. I uh, like vanilla custards and everything else. I've been actually looking for a nice vanilla vape. And has pod salt, nick salt, hit the spot? Here we have it in the Valadin. And again, this is, this one's actually an 11 milligram um, Nick Salt. And yes, it has. It's, a not a non, it's an uncomplicated 
uncomplicated Nick Salt. It's just a lovely balance of a, of a vanilla flavour. And people say van vanilla is probably plain and boring. I maybe I'm plain and boring, but I really do. I like this vanilla. To me, it is just a perfect, perfect all day vape. And it's even better after a cup of coffee. Um, and in the middle, it's just the same. There's no difference in it whatsoever. Okay, so that was the vanilla. Next up is the big tasty. And this one is Coca-Cola with lime. You've had Coca-Cola with lemon and everything else with vapes, Coca-Cola with lime. And I have this in my trusty little meadow. So straight away you're getting that cola flavour coming through there. It's just balanced enough. And then just right at the very back you're getting that lime and you're left with the lime in your mouth. It is a beautiful, beautiful flavour. I can't remember if I gave the vanilla a score. If I didn't, the vanilla is a 10 out of 10. Don't know where that came from in my head there, so do apologise. Um, but yeah, you get left with that lovely, lovely lime flavour in your mouth. Again, all of these, even though these are 20 milligrams, there's no, it's a very smooth throat hit on the back note there. You know, you can vape these all day without worrying. You know, and I've had no throat irritation from them whatsoever. Um, so, cola and lime, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Yeah, good solid 9 out of 10. Okay, and last up is Yogi. And Yogi is a peanut butter banana granola. This is one I was mm, dubious, would I say, of tasting? Probably was dubious of tasting. And we have that in the beautiful Rainbow Valadin. And I was surprised, pleasantly surprised, yeah. Really, really pleasantly surprised with this. The banana is a to ripe banana as opposed to the sweetie foam bananas you get. And the peanut butter, it doesn't over, overpower it. Quite a few other peanut butter vapes that I've tried, the peanut butter just overpowers it and you just get nothing of anything else. Now, the granola, cereal type of thing, it just, it does hide. I'm not, I'm, me personally, I'm not picking that up. Not to say that you might not, but me personally, I'm not picking that up. But I'm finding the banana and the peanut butter is just a little perfect match. And it is a beautiful, beautiful vape. And I'm going to give peanut butter granola nine and a half out of ten. So that's the four, that's four of them, um, the range from Pod Salt. There is quite a lot more of the juices to come, folks. Um, if you've enjoyed, excuse me. Just have to go for that. Just have to go back for my vanilla. Um, yeah, if you've enjoyed my review on the Pod Salts, folks, I'm going to stick a link down below to, to my Vapery. Um, and you can pick up Pod Salts in quite a few places. So. There's a big range of ones out there to go. Um, I've still got a lot more of them to review, and I'll probably just keep doing them in these four at a time reviews, um, short reviews. So, Pod Salts gets a huge thumbs up from me. Um, I have to must thank the guys over at Pod Salts for giving me for the giving me these for the purpose of review over at Expo, on top of the ones I'd really bought because I had bought some before the hour and you was reviewer. Um, if you've enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up and drop me a wee comment down below. If you haven't enjoyed my video and you're putting me a thumbs down, leave me a comment. Come on guys, the least you can do, if you're taking the time to put a, com put a thumbs down, the least you can do is leave me a comment. I'm not going to share that, geez. And finally, you will get links up here and down here if you're on YouTube. If you're not, if you're over on VapeTube, there's no links, so just hang about and the next video will come along. 
and remains me to say is good morning, good afternoon, wherever you're watching this review. Take care now. Bye. <laughs>